farmer's field. Beans everywhere. Just did some major bushwhacking. We are on a foraging trip today in Sandy Lands. Marshawn the Brokery. Sandy Lands Provincial Forest hunting for hazelnuts. Uh, we started off looking for chanterelles, but it's been uh, quite dry. Other than the last uh, week, we had a couple of days of rain, but it's been very, very dry, so we haven't had any success finding chanterelles today. So, we're going to try for hazelnuts, which is proving to be a little difficult right now, too. Maybe I'll come back after another pause, see what we find. This is different kinds, of huh? That's the one that uh, oh, they fall. I'm grabbing to my hands, they fall right away. So that's what happened over there. Finally, after hunting today for a couple hours, Where we, we hit early? some jackpot. You have to pick them early. Yeah. Bushwhacking. Oh. We're surrounded here by hazelnuts. And we got the spicy kind, right, Paul? Yeah. Got spicy and regular. So the difference is, I took a picture, but these are the regular. And then spicy hazelnuts have a bit of a, they go more like longer and curve down like that. Woo, jackpot. Hey, now we found a much easier spot. Rather than bushwhacking and bushwhacking and bending under and over all the tall trees, we're along the ditch the local road here in between uh, La Brokery and St. Anne's, Manitoba. And nice and low. Just watching along. Look at these beauties. Hazelnuts. And these are less dry too. When we went in the deep bush, a lot of tall trees and a lot of things you can trip over. Oh, yeah, but you just... And then there's different steps too. Once you bring these home, you got to let them uh, dry out. Then you scale off, peel them off, and then you dry them off again before they're ready to crack open and eat. But live off the land. This is beautiful. The boys are getting excited. Woohoo! Say hi to everybody on the video. <laughs> There, monster patch, you guys. We have like, hit the yeah, gold here, well, just in the ditch. <laughs> Slow, show, uh, shallow, easy to pick, and then. <laughs> so, Paul, oh. this is my brother Paul, the uh, <laughs> expert <laughs> forager. Oh, Look at his pail. Nice. Your pail is almost done. So, Paul, how long do we leave these? You said again about for three days. You leave about three, four days. They yeah. curl up and you pop up with your thumb. Yeah, you peel them off. And then uh, you leave them for two weeks on the table. Yeah. And then you can start cracking and eating. Eating them. Awesome. Yeah. That's how you guys, we yeah. forge oh, hazelnuts. Yeah. Wild. Oh no <laughs> chemicals, no nothing, <laughs> straight from the land. <laughs> I don't believe that. We're all ecstatic yeah, I'm not, here. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, hey, look at this. Yeah, abundance. Yeah, you, abundance, yeah, abundance. Like this, and they're small. Abundance. I not go here, I said. You can feel the weight. It's ready to eat. This you can just crack and crack eat. Crack and Wash it all. Oh, that's what you can eat. Wash uh, Jim Roger. Wash your yeah. uh, <laughs> take as yeah. you crack. But I do it for uh, living the off yeah. the land. I got a lot of blueberries. P and J's berry blossoms. <laughs> Look at this. These you picked how long ago, Paul? This I picked. You had little, picked? I started uh, the little pot. I started August eighth when oh, I yeah. went to pick the last pill of blueberries. And this is from and then today's. I started picking these and I traded. This is from today's forging. Pot. So dark ones for about three days now and then you peel we them again now we found more here see tomorrow, some are a little bit drier we're gonna go back over, not tomorrow but the next day after I'm these ones are really green and then, uh, so you yeah. wait for about three That's days awesome. and they'll peel easily and then yeah, you and dry them for another here. two weeks yeah. week and a half yeah. maybe for yeah. these yeah. ones I made 35, ready to eat thanks everyone this is janine signing out from 19 tribes 
It was a great day for forging hazelnuts. Yeah.